Whether it be after a long day out on the range or just one of those days behind your desk, it's time to kick off your boots, your shoes, and enjoy a bourbon. Make that a California cowboy bourbon. Let's do this, partner. Welcome back to the My Bourbon Journey Whiskey Review Channel. My name is Scott. So today we're gonna to be getting into California cowboy straight bourbon whiskey. This is coming in at 88 proof or 44% ABV. Uh, this is distilled in Kentucky and bottled in California. It is non-age stated. However, I was able to verify that it is a minimum of two years with it being a straight bourbon whiskey. Uh, mash bill undisclosed. And MSRP on this one is right around that $35 uh, price point. So typically what I try to do with my reviews is we'll get into the appearance, we'll nose it, taste it, uh, and then get into really anything else having to do with the, uh, with the whiskey itself. So, all right, so as you can see, color-wise, you know, kind of a nice, you know, gold, like a light gold type of, of color to it. So, and again, two years old, so you're not gonna pull out you know, a ton of color uh, for the most part on this. So, all right, let's get into the, uh, let's get into the nose. Hmm. Really like a nice, um, like nice vanilla, like a confectionery type of, of uh, nose right away. Some like light baking spices, light oak, uh, even a, a bit of like a green apple uh, aspect to it. Slight black pepper there. Uh, a little bit of like a medium or light cinnamon note. Uh, you, I mean, you get a little bit of that youth that's there again. I mean, it's two years old, so you're going to get still some of that graininess that's there. But it's it's not super like youth in your face. It's not an overly grainy uh, whiskey at all. Yeah, definitely get some of that like kind of confectionery sweetness that's there on it as well. All right, let's go ahead and get it. And as I move around the glass, it's fairly oily. Um, I'm guessing this probably has to be chill filtered, um, but it's actually got really, really nice um, like oils to it. So I'm not sure if it is, but just based on this, it's very, very oily. So that's, that's nice to see at something that's a little bit on the, the lower proof. Uh, side of things. So more importantly, let's uh, let's see how this one tastes. Cheers. So my first thought right away is a great rye spice to it. Absolutely fantastic rye spice, actually. Some black peppers kind of coming out a little bit. Some of that light or medium oak presence to it. Then here kind of comes some of the sweetness, more of that confectionery, the vanillas, the caramels, a little bit of a honey aspect to it there as well. Even a, a slight uh, citrus, like more of like an orange peel uh, to that. Again, some more of that cinnamon kind of comes out. Yeah, the vanillas, the caramels, a very traditional like bourbon or bourbon type of uh, profile to this one. You know, all the flavors that are there, just a little bit more on the, the muted side. You know, as far as, you know, what it is, it's a two year, you know, Kentucky bourbon that they're bottling in California. And it, it kind of, it is what it is. You know, you know what you're gonna be getting with that. It's not gonna be overly complex. If you're looking for traditional, you know, bourbon profile, you know, one that's easy to sip on kind of as a daily sipping type of bourbon. Perfect. May hold up really well in cocktails. And the reason I say that is because of the spice part of it. I think that part of it is really what will help this, you know, in a cocktail. If that spice wasn't there, I would say probably not as much, but I think with the, the spice and the black pepper that's there may do really well, like in an old fashioned maybe even like a Manhattan, something along uh, those lines. Uh, finish wise, I would say this is probably the shorter side of medium, maybe. Um, again, you get some of that lingering spice that's there, the vanillas, the caramel, that light oak. Again, it kind of goes back to just the very traditional like bourbon uh, profile. 
just with a little bit of that youth that's there. So you get still some of that kind of confectionery uh, sweetness that that's on it. But you know, very sippable, approachable. You know, for somebody who's being introduced to to bourbon or looking for something that isn't going to kind of kill their palate, this would be a good place to start. I think there's still some sweetness that's there with a little bit of that lingering spice. So you get a good idea of you know what a bourbon may have to to offer from the standpoint of of exactly what this has um, you know to offer. So again, California Cowboy um, Bourbon. This is their uh, basically a Kentucky uh, straight bourbon whiskey. Again, distilled in Kentucky, bottled in in California. So with that being said, so remember like subscribe. More importantly. Let me know your thoughts. Is this a bourbon that you've tried? Your thoughts on it? You know, kind of some of your experiences with it. I'm always interested to hear people's feedback on the whiskeys that I'm doing uh, reviews of. So, also, if you'd like to help support or contribute to the channel, you can through my Patreon page, which I'll have linked in the description below. Uh, also, uh, if you'd like to uh, follow me on Instagram, you can. Same thing with uh, Twitter and uh, Facebook. So with that being said, remember, it's about the journey and not the destination. Cheers.